I think probably now we can go to the part which devoted to new devices that you created. <laughs> and uh, I want to ask you about first probably would be Miramate prostate pack. So oh, what is, can you have introduction and what uh, diseases well, it can help? Yeah, you know, I did a, I did a, a, a video on this prostate pack just a little while ago. It's, it's amazing, absolutely amazing. It's, it's, um, you won't believe the size of it. The main unit is huge. Look at that. Mm -hmm. And it's got these like cartoon buttons too. He wanted things large so that people who are in the age group that would most likely use this product are able to do so. Um, what does it do? What does it, um, how does it help people? Well, first a bit of background. We wanted to design a device which uh, treated a condition that if every, every man lived old enough, they would suffer from. By the time you reach 60, most men have an enlarged prostate. Not, a, not prostate cancer, just an enlarged prostate. And they'll get the symptoms of slow urine flow, multiple, um, you know, wanting to um, empty your, you know, your bladder often. Um, now, if you're 60 and you're having to wake up many times to go to toilet, you become tired, your immune system starts dropping, and then another health condition will start up. Because you, you might even get a cancer, right? It, it, which is the example I gave earlier on, maybe you, you get a tumor developed. You wouldn't think that having to go toilet often at nighttime would end up with you with a cancer, a life-threatening cancer. But this, this could be the, the, the cause of aging. And so you can do something which is proactive and prevent um, that from happening by using a product like this one here. And you think our one is the best. Um, what it does is through the application of high power lasers, um, it uh, reduces the prostate size over a period of time. Um, mm -hmm. Now we didn't do the trials to find the optimum way of applying the lights. Uh, we got them from research papers that were hidden in China. <laughs> In China, they've got more freedom um, in the medical uh, world of publishing things. And this was published, it was, you know, obviously it's in Chinese, so it's, it's not really, not easily found in Western countries. And it's kind of a shame. You'll know yourself actually with, um, with, with um, your, I forget which country you came from, Slo Slovakia. Which country did you, were you born? Oh, I, I was born in Russia. In <laughs> Russia. Oh, okay, fantastic. Russia um, is the, well, still the, the leader in um, the uh, NLS diagnostic system devices and, and others. But the papers, the research papers are written in Russian. And so they're not available to Western countries. They would, you wouldn't know where to start looking for them. Um, but we, we found these papers that were, you know, uh, published mm -hmm. in China only and used the findings to create this device. Uh, we, we copied it. We copied the, um, this lab equipment, reduced a device, you know, the size of a large briefcase to something the size of a large, I don't know, <laughs> a large something. <laughs> Couldn't get it any smaller because you need to have high power. And there's a limit. There's a limit to how small you can make the high power things, but we made it smaller and available for um, everyone to use. Um, but this device, you strap on this, um, this device. You, you strap this onto the uh, front of your body, and you strap this onto the back of your body. It's got belts that um, that you can just tie up. And there's a um, another LED light. These are two. These are both very high power LED lights. Uh, there's another LED light which we call the 
the LED cannon. This is the ballistic one. This goes uh, between your scrotum and your anus. Uh, the positioning is important because there's uh, different meridian points that they found that um, if you place them over these uh, meridians, the, um, the effects are quite startling. They're not instantaneous. It still takes like six months or more to see the effect. But after one year, there wasn't one person. Oh, sorry, there are, oh, yeah, that's right. There are, I think there are three people out of a group of 26 that didn't have any results. And those three people were the oldest ones that were there. So maybe at, above a certain age, it doesn't have much of an effect. But the, um, what it does, it applies um, at the different acupoints, the light. And the light, uh, the, the, uh, through Chinese magic, <laughs> by Chinese magic, I'm talking about ancient, um, you know, the, the, um, the meridian energy flows that are throughout your body. If you apply the light exactly how they did during the trials, um, the, the uh, results are actually amazing. There wasn't um, one person, I think, that there wasn't anyone that had zero uh, response. But um, yeah, it's, I, I created a, um, a PowerPoint for, um, for the, um, for the um, prostate pack. I can't find it this at the moment. But it's, it's, it's good because just think about it. When we get older, it's like we are going to have a swollen prostate. It's not like, you know, there's a certain chance, like there's a certain chance of other health conditions. You will get an enlarged prostate. But we've now brought to the market a device that can remedy that. And so all of a sudden you get this in the mail, right? Wow, this is what empowerment feels like. <laughs> feels good, you know? Um, these machines are used now in Chinese clinics. You've got, got to go in there, lie down, you get strapped up by, um, by the doctor and then you've got to sit still for half an hour. Um, not very nice, fighting your way through traffic. The inconvenience is bad. You've got the inconvenience. You've got the embarrassment of having to drop your trousers in front of a, a stranger and, and lie in an awkward position in a place where you don't feel comfortable because everyone's wearing white overcoats. Well, you can do this in the comfort of your home. There's no reason why not because it's perfectly safe. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it, we are very proud of it. This is one of our most recent devices. The power from this device is quite remarkable. In every single LED, in the blankets, both fore, aft, and underneath, is exactly the specification, both with power levels, the number of LEDs, and also the wavelength to what was used in the uh, trials. So we can perfectly replicate uh, what the trials found. There are two trials that were held in China, actually, that we know of. Um, both of them, they're independent, actually. Uh, but curiously enough, the device that they came up as the, what they found as the ideal, were, the, were identical to each other. It was really remarkable. And who would have thought? But I guess the meridian circuits are the same for everybody. And so they'd be moving this LED cannon around. No, 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 let's fly down here. No. And they've got, uh, they're using uh, acupuncture needles to measure the, their bodily response to the certain placements. They know when, when, um, when the meridian's being cleared and um, yeah, they found the, uh, the sweet spots to uh, apply the high energy photons to your body. And also they found out the uh, different wavelengths to use. They're trying different, um, different colors of LEDs because with LEDs you can get the red, orange, yellow, blue, green, all of that. And they found that red and blue were the two best combinations. Anything past that, you're looking like a Christmas tree and it's not really having much of a benefit. Perhaps possibly a benefit in sales because if a device looks more beautiful, it'll sell more. But we don't, we don't sell devices just that they just look beautiful. They've got to actually do their job and we want to get the best 
And so if we put a different color in there, it's going to mean you've got one less red one, for example, <laughs> and red is necessary, one of the necessary wavelengths. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you also have uh, cold laser wrist three and wrist X, yes? Yes. I'll, I'll put this to one side. Yes, we've got um, two wrist devices. This is our our regular cold laser wrist, but I won't open this box, I'll open the other box. These are really cool. Now, um, we were saying earlier on about energy levels. Now, because I keep my health very good, not just good, very good, uh, this kind of device is really good for someone like me because it's portable, everything's self-contained. Now, I'll open up the wrist X. The wrist X is the deluxe model. It's the one that most people are, um, are buying. And it's little wonder because it's quite an amazing, ah, you think I'd know how to open the box by now. There we go. <laughs> it's an amazing device. The um, cold laser wrist X, it's a laser device. It has got some LEDs as well for the same reason of the, um, the prostate pack for Stim stimulating the meridian points on your wrist. You can see the, all the number of lasers that are there. We're not shy with um, when you design okay. our product. This device, uh, does it require a generator too? Because yeah. I, this one does not, yeah? Uh, so I'll, it's show you. I'll show you how. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, okay. But uh, ordinary cold laser, laser, it requires, of course, a generator, yes? Uh, well, we've got cold laser devices which are, are designed for connecting onto a generator because then you can apply frequency. In that instance, uh, you need a generator because then you can choose the programs and apply them. Remember earlier mm -hmm. on, we we're talking about different ways of applying frequencies. Well, light is one such, such way of applying the frequency. Now, while I've been talking and, and mumbling, I've put on my uh, cold laser wrist X. And let's push the on and off button to select it. And then, uh, oops. Okay, so it started now and it started the countdown. The laser is actually working as, as we speak. So just push this button, push it again, and it runs on the default. I can handle a device like this because it's a no brainer. It's, it's so simple to use. But look, no wires. <laughs> so I can be mm -hmm. doing whatever I want. Now, I haven't told you what this device actually does, though, have I? What this no. device does, <laughs> it does stimulate the acupoints in your wrist. We've got um, two important ones there. But uh, equally important, or possibly more important, if you're feeling, um, if your energy levels and things are low, it purifies your blood. By purifying, I mean unclumps your red blood cells, so your blood cells become more separated. If you've got, for example, two blood cells together, the surface area presented to the cells or to the, to the lungs, you know, any exchange that the cell has to make with tissue, suddenly you've got a little over half the area of the two combined. But if it's separated, each cell has got its full area exposed. So it makes your body more efficient. Now, during the days, uh, which wasn't that long ago, when you were running thousands of kilometers per day, <laughs> this sort of device would have been ideal because you would find that your baseline fitness raises by an increment. No matter how fit you are, you'll benefit from one of these. Now, your, um, your body's exchange mechanism from uh, oxygen to hemoglobin back, you know, then CO2 back out again. Um, that exchange is improved through this device. It also um, has um, the effect of removing pathogens in your blood. If you've got a blood-borne disease, uh, the cold laser can penetrate the thin skin of your wrist the lasers are on a slight angle and they follow your 
uh, your two arteries there. And so your blood is exposed to the laser light longer than um, would be if it was just one or two lights there. And so for perhaps four or five seconds, your blood has got high in intensity light being applied to it. So they're the two main uh, um, functions of this unit. The fact that it can pur purify blood and remove pathogens from your blood. It also seems to give you more energy for whatever reason. Now, cold laser can um, increase the, or recharge the batteries inside your cells. Um, they call it the mitochondria. It just stimulates it. Well, it seems to do that with the cells in your blood, and it seems to give an overall um, benefit through your body. Um, it's, a, it's a very cool device, so, so convenient. And I like devices like that. <laughs> Um, this unit has got a flat battery because it's just turned itself off. <laughs> but, you know, this is just for demonstration purposes. So that's a device that we've um, just released very recently. It has got a, a younger brother, which is the cold laser wrist. It looks, it looks identical, similar sort of thing, but it hasn't got so many light sources on the wrist. So it hasn't got so many lasers. 